YouTube friends and welcome to my channel new and returning subscribers it's Margie from the budget evolution where we have fun saving our money um, normally I would start the month off with our monthly budget and then I would give you our first bi-weekly or weekly budget right well <sighs> I recorded the monthly budget twice and the first one I had so many mistakes so I was like no I'm gonna re-record it so I went to go re-record it thought I was doing fine went on to do the um, the first paycheck and guess what for some reason it only recorded for 15 seconds and then for some reason it just stopped and I didn't know it stopped so obviously I'm going through and I'm doing the budget and then I go back and I look and I'm like where did what happened <laughs> I only got like the first couple of seconds so let me check we're still recording <laughs> I don't know what happened three times I re was recording three times and both three times after about 15 seconds the the recording just stopped and it's not memory because I have plenty of memory on my phone, so I don't know what it is. So we're just going to quickly look at our April budget because um, <clears throat> it's already filled out, already done. Um, our goals was um, is to reach 800 subscribers this month. And I want to thank all of you new subscribers, especially because you have made me reach 700 subscribers. I want to thank you and welcome to my channel. Um, so we're trying to reach 800 and the reason why is because we're going to do a giveaway So that's the first thing then our no spend challenge um, Last month we only hit 11 days of no spend. I want to hit more than 15. So I'm Seriously working very hard on that. We're gonna get three paychecks out of this month uh, Both mine two bi-weekly and then my husband's monthly which is going to give us four thousand seven hundred and seventy dollars to work with all of our bills sinking funds, cash envelopes. I'm not going to go through it because we're actually going to go straight to the first paycheck in the month of April, which is today's, which is come, what came out today. Um, 13.6603, we left $6.03 in the bank and we, uh, we took out 1,360. So we're going to go over all, everything that's on here and let's, yeah. <laughs> I can't believe I lost that video. I don't even know what happened. So we are going to set this off to the side so I can still see it. And we're going to count up our money. So I didn't even get a chance to, to show you um, some little tchotchkes on my thing. I didn't know what to do for spring. Um, I really didn't have any flowers out and I didn't want to go digging through the basement. So I saw this sitting over on my daughter's because I record in my daughter's room because right now that's the available room, which is actually I'm going to have to change it because she's coming home in October. I need to move out and I'll have to reset up um, my recording little studio here I'm gonna have to set it up in my den so right now I'm cleaning out my den in order to fit another desk in my den so it's always set up um, I like it that way because I, I can't imagine I, I did it in the beginning in my sewing room and you know I would break it down put it back break it down but no it's just it's too much work so anyway I saw this sitting on her shelf and I thought it was really cute and it looked um, kind of Springy because uh, they're a little her girlfriend made these for her I think for her birthday maybe it might have been her 18th birthday and they're paper and she made these little stars like origami stars uh, they're all different sizes and I just thought it was so cute because a lot of them are pink and then like blues and light greens so I, I was like oh that's adorable so I you know what I was like I'm gonna put it in my video over here we have flowers that just came out of my sewing room because I used that in a project for uh, one of the dance costumes. I made 12 flower costumes, as we call them. So I was like, I had extra and I was like, oh, they kind of look like cherry blossoms. So that's what I did. And then this is kind of like the one that we did here where we had that clay station place where she, my daughter could paint. So as she got better, she did a dolphin. So she painted that dolphin. Oh, see? <laughs> I even have white out that's still sitting here still open because <laughs> I was doing my video and yeah anyway let's count our money we should have 
1360. I'm going to, because I kind of like to count. Big bills, just little bills. Actually, I need my, I need my calculator. So let's get that out. So we have one, two, three, four hundred. 51, 52, 53, 50. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 80. So 280. Our tens is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. So that's 220. 5, 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 70. And then we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 40. Oops, there we go. And the bills look very nice, and there's a reason why. Because when I did my unstuffing, instead of going to the bank, I took out my first paycheck out of the nicest bills out of that unstuffing. So that's why these bills look really nice, and that's why we wouldn't have any J bucks because it was money we already had here um, before we put up my unstuffing back into the bank. So that was 1360. Now let's get to stuffing so we usually start with bills so why don't we do that and we're going to be doing let's see i didn't even do my trackers you know we're, we'll, we'll, i'll do my trackers later so we got 115 dollars is going into electric and these are for may bills homeowners insurance is going to be 185 so 150 20 80 and 5. Internet is going to be 60, so a 50 and a 10. <coughs> Excuse me, I didn't mean to cough into the <coughs> video. I, I've been having a tickle. You know what? I'm going to take a little sip of water. Hopefully that will help <laughs> as we're stuffing water. That's funny. So 53 for water. So one, two, and three. And then we're gonna skip down to, let's see, cash envelopes. So we're gonna go right to hubby, spending. Hubby is gonna get $50. So hubby now has 150, 210. Uh, dining out is going to get 50. Oops, one more. Dining out is gonna just get $50. There we go. So that takes care of that. I'm gonna get my wallet out, which I didn't have to run down the stairs and get because I remembered. And we do have a little bit of money left over. We have $20 in gas left over. So I'm gonna leave that in there. Um, actually, no, I'm not because we're taking gas out. We're getting $50 for gas. I'm taking this 20 out and guess where I'm gonna put it? I'm going to put it into our miscellaneous fund because we've been spending a little bit extra in um, groceries. So I was thinking, you know what? We need like a little bit of a buffer. So whatever I have left over or what, not necessarily whatever my husband left over because he hardly ever spends money. But anyway, um, at least whatever I have left over, I'm going to put towards um, the miscellaneous fund to cover, you know, extra charges. Um, and if we obviously, you, know, you when you watch my unstuffing, if I need money, I'm obviously going to take it from my husband. <laughs> Why not, you know? So 50 going into gas for me. And I'm going to take 50 for my spending. So I'm going to take two 20s and a 10. And that is my stuffing. 
whoops, that goes back to the bank. That's money that I used on my credit card that I have to put back in the bank for the next unstuffing. All right, next we're going to sinking funds and we are gonna start with medical. Our uh, prescriptions and medical. So we're doing $40, so 20, 40. Medical now has 20, 40, 50, one, two, three. So 53 dollars in prescriptions. And this is gonna kind of come out little by little because um, you know we're at the beginning of the year and a lot of our deductibles are coming out for prescriptions. So that's where we are. So car maintenance, we're doing 50. Car maintenance now has $200. Life insurance is getting 26. 26. Oh. Life insurance now has 20, 45, 51, 52. Uh, utilities authority is going to get 30 so 20 and 30 so 50 70 90 110 120 so 120 dollars in utilities this comes out every six months so that's why that's building up in there dmv is normally i have my notes in front of me and this one's off to the side so let me just check DMV is 15 and we're actually probably going to have to unstuff this before the end of the month because one of the registrations for the cars uh, is uh, it's actually sitting on my desk and I have to pay it so I'll have to just do that off camera. So we have 150, 150, 170, 190, 200, 10, 12, 212 dollars in DMV. Okay, yearly subscriptions, I put memberships, it doesn't matter, it's all the same, is getting $34. So we get 20, 30, one, two, three, and four. So let's Count that. So is that 150, 70, 80, 90, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So 197 in yearly subscriptions. And then we got to do J House. And that is in the big pink binder. <clears throat> so sad that that's bent. I'll have to get a new one. Oh, I'll have to get the one that says Hello Spring. Do you guys remember that from last year? So we are going to stuff $200, one and two. So J House has one, two, three, 50, 365, 67, 66, 67, 68. So 368 in J House. What? <laughs> I'm like, what? I was like, no, we don't. We got more money than there now. There's $500 in our high yield savings account. So that's five, that's six, seven, 850, 65, 68. So $868 is actually in her fund. And that's to help pay for her rent and stuff. And actually her rent, her loan covered her rent up until this month. April. Um, May, June, July, and August, my husband and I are going to have to cover, and it's pretty close to $1,000 a month. So we are actually going to take that out of his part of his 401k that we're taking out for him for 2024. Now we're going to do our two months ahead because, you know, we've got to pay for her summer classes. We have to pay for her rental property in Savannah. Um, and then what else do we have to pay for? Oh, her moving costs, because she's got to move out of her house. And was there something else? No, I, and rent. <laughs> Four months of rent, so that's $4,000 right there. 
So we are going to stuff our two months ahead binder. We need $21 bills. So let me count that real fast. The rest of this is for savings challenges. So that'll be in a different video. So I'm gonna get my paperweight. Oh, let me reach over here. So it doesn't slide all over the place. Each envelope is gonna get a dollar except for the last one. Okay, so we are on now water. Water is gonna get $4 because in my last stuffing, we fully funded, what was this, Capital One? Capital One Savings. So we have three fully funded tolls, monthly subscriptions, and Capital One, and now we are on water. So let's see where we're at. So 20, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, and I think in my last video I said we only needed $7 to fully fund it, and I was like, yeah, that was wrong. <laughs> So we actually need now $6 to fully fund this. I think it was $11 or something at that point. So there we are with that and that is done. And that is the, that, that's all, that's all, that's all folks. <laughs> so I want to thank you all so much for watching. Please like subscribe and share, and I will see you in the next video. Bye everyone.